So I've had severe dry eyes for about six months now due to excessive use of contact lenses. Um, I've been to several eye doctors and the one I'm currently going to at first told me I had scarring on my eyes from the rubbing of the contacts on dry eyes. So he gave me these eye drops to put in four times a day to clear up the scarring and eventually it cleared up which was great, and my eyes were still dry. So I'm using all these things, still currently, for a dry eye therapy. I have doxycycline that I take once a day, prescription medication. I have refresh eye drops that I'm supposed to put in four times a day, just whenever my eyes are feeling dry, just spread it out throughout the day. I have an eye ointment that I have to squeeze into my eyelids every night before I go to bed and take two tablets of flaxseed oil every day with uh, whatever I'm eating, lunch and dinner. And after the third trip back to the eye doctor, he gave me this little bottle of Prolenza, which is an anti-inflammatory, and I'm supposed to put it in every morning to start my day off with some nice lubricated eyes. So for one of my eye therapies, every day I'm supposed to put a hot compress on it and I just heat one up. It's like a little bean bag thing and I basically just leave it on my eyes until it's not hot anymore. So I'm going to do that now and hopefully it helps a little bit. Okay, so I just got home. And it's kind of gloomy out today, so my eyes aren't feeling too inflamed. And I'm going to put in my eye drops. I'm supposed to put these in uh, four times a day, but I don't think it's good to put them in a lot because apparently they make your eyes even drier if you use them too much. But I'm going to put them in now just because it's part of my therapy. Put one drop in this eye. One drop in this eye. And that's it. So I just came back from yet another eye doctor appointment. And he told me that he suspects my dry eyes are partially from allergies. So he gave me, um, well first he suggested that I get this mint. I think it was called Alivert. And it's these little mints that you can take anytime you want. And it just melts right in your mouth and it's supposed to help with allergy symptoms. And he also gave me yet another drop for my eyes. It's called Bepreve. And he told me to put them in twice a day, anytime I wanted. And I'm just supposed to keep going with my eye therapy, which is all these drops and ointments and hot compresses that I have to do every day. Um, I still haven't found any relief. They're just, my eyes are constantly just dry and achy and sore every day. Um, my mom has been saying that she would like to try a new eye doctor, so I'm definitely on board with that. And hopefully something works. Okay, so I'm about to go to sleep and it's time for me to put in my eye ointment, which I put in every night before I go to bed. Uh, I'm not actually going to put it on on camera because it's kind of hard to see, but I will demonstrate how I use it. Basically, you pull your eyelid down, you squeeze it into your eye, squeeze it into the other eye, and then you're done. Um, they tell me to put it in before I go to bed because it's, it's really hard to see when you put the gel in your eye, um, but it feels really good for my dry eyes because... It kind of gels my eye up, so I kind of forget about the dryness for a while, which is nice to have some relief at least for, you know, an hour or so. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to go put this in for real, and that's it. Okay, so I just ate my dinner, and now it's time for me to take my flaxseed oil pill. Um, I take it twice a day with my lunch and my dinner, and... Basically, it's just a natural supplement that you buy at the supermarket and my eye doctor told me it helps with dry eyes and also during my extensive research on dry eyes, I've also seen it on many websites recommending it 
as a good treatment option if you have dry eyes. This is the pill. Um, it's pretty big. The first time I saw it, I was surprised. I thought I would never be able to swallow it, but now I'm used to it. So, here we go. Alright. Um, I haven't noticed much difference w from taking these pills. Um, nothing's really helped me still. Um, some days just seem better than others. Something that I have realized is that my eyes usually feel better at night, um, more so than during the day, probably has something to do with maybe I get allergies during the day, um, but we'll just keep going and see what happens. So today's the final day of my documentary recording, and all week my eyes haven't really felt any different. Um, I've been continuing my treatment and haven't missed one day, but... Still, I haven't found any kind of eye relief. Um, my mom actually bought me this eye mask uh, to wear over my eyes when I go to sleep. She thinks maybe my eyes aren't closed all the way when I'm sleeping at night and that's contributing to the problem. Um, so I've been wearing that every night. Um, I also made an appointment at a different eye doctor. Um, he's an eye surgeon and he also specializes in contact lenses. Uh, my doctor this whole time has just been my local optometrist. He pretty much told me that he doesn't know what else he can do. Uh, he just assumed that it was allergies. That was the last thing that he left me with. But uh, my mom thinks, and I think it's better to see someone else. Um, it is frustrating every day, but I'm just trying to keep my head up and hope that I can figure out what's causing my eye dryness.